please welcome our visiting professor of entrepreneurship, Kane Monroy. Kane! <laughs> Welcome. Is this your first time to USC? Yeah. We're glad to have. And you live pretty close by, right? No. Oh. <laughs> How far of a drive? Like one hour. One hour? Then your father got lost on the way here. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we're, let's, we're going to talk about how you started Kane's Arcade, how you thought of Kane's Arcade. But let's talk first about where is Kane's Arcade right now? Where are the games? Um, in San Francisco. In San Francisco. What are they doing in San Francisco? It's there for the, for the museum. Which like museum? So, but the, oh, I forgot the name. Like Museum of Play, Children's Museum? Yeah. And how did it get up there? And the trailer. A big trailer. They packed cardboard up in a big trailer. And did you pack it up personally? Yeah. How did you protect the cardboard? They put blankets over it. <laughs> you put blankets over it. So you can imagine this semi truck that used to, you know, haul the heaviest things on the road is hauling your cardboard arcade up to San Francisco. Did you go up to San Francisco? Yeah. Yeah. And what did you see there? I saw people, they were playing the arcade. They were playing your arcade? Did people recognize you? Yeah. What did they say? That's Kane. <laughs> <laughs> and was it fun? Yeah. When did, you just got back recently, right? Yeah. Okay. So let's talk about how old are you? Nine. You're nine. And where do you go to school? Los Altos Elementary. Los Altos Elementary. What grade are you in? Fourth. Fourth. You have any brothers or sisters? Yeah. How many? Two. What are their names? Zach and George. Who's here? Zach. Zach's here. Where's Zach? And there's Zach. And then your, your dad, George, is here. We'll say hi to your dad. Uh, you obviously drove with him. He's not new to you. We'll, uh, we'll talk to him. He's also an entrepreneur. So you have two entrepreneurs in the family, plus Zach. He may be one, too. Um, is, your, is your arcade the first business you started, or did you try other things first? The first business. It's the first business where you had customers and everything. And, and um, how, old you, how old were you when, you when you started the arcade? Like eight years old. Eight years old. So you're, you're little then. Yes. Just kidding. <laughs> well, there you go. And um, why did you, you know, we talk about why, why you go into business, why you do things. Why did you build an arcade? I wanted to have fun. You wanted to have fun? Yeah. That's it? You always wanted to have fun? Yeah. Did you want to make money? Nah. No, it was about fun, right? Yeah. Good. We just got done talking about that. That <laughs> you, you're, you're covering, so you could teach this whole semester, by the way. You're, you're covering all the things. But you started out to have fun, right? Yeah. And so you, why did you see these cardboard boxes and think you could make something? Did, did, you, did you already experience an arcade and like that? No. You've never been to an arcade? Yeah. And, but you, you have fun with those? Yeah. And so you know how to win and get the prizes and all that stuff? Yeah. So your father uh, and his father, your grandfather, started an auto parts and salvage yard in, uh, in Los Angeles. And w what were they doing with the boxes? Throw them away. And they were throwing away boxes, good boxes. Yeah. <laughs> and what did you see when you saw those boxes? I can make something out of it. Out of boxes. And right away, did you know you wanted to make an arcade? No. No? When did you, and, and so when you saw the boxes, tell us how, how you made some of the games. I cut them up. I made like circles in the boxes. <laughs> so you put the ball inside and it rolls in and it gets in the hole. So your first, uh, your, let's talk about your first game was which game? Basketball. Basketball, where the customer has to throw the ball through the hoop. Yeah. Where would you get the hoop? I shake each pizza. Shake each pizza. <laughs> Serving delicious warm pizza for <laughs> 90 years. Shakey's. <laughs> We're going to get you some endorsements today. Um, so you're, uh, you make the, the, that's your first game. What's your second game? Um, soccer. Soccer. The one we saw in the video where you had to kick through the army guys? Yeah. Okay. And how many games have you made in total now? Like five or six. Five or six games. So when, uh, oh, let's, let's talk about the uniform, the, u the now famous uniform. When you had to, you wanted to get shirts made, right? Yeah. Who picked the color? I did. And what color, you wanted blue? Yeah. 
What did you want it to say on the back? Kate's Arcade. And didn't you also ask the woman to put the address and the telephone number? Yeah. What did she tell you? No. Why? <laughs> oh, I forgot. Oh. She's, she said, well, you don't want them to know your address and, and where to find you. And what did you say? I do. Because <laughs> you want everyone to find Kane's Arcade, right? Yeah. And what did you put on the front of the shirt? Staff. And where did you see that word before? At the mall. <laughs> did you know what it mean, meant at the time? No. <laughs> so why did you want it on your shirt? Because it meant something like people that work there. People that work there, and you work at your arcade, and you knew it was important, right? Yeah. That's great. That's great. And um, when did you actually open the arcade for business? Like in June. June of 2000. 11. June of 2011. So, June of 2011. So, it's during the summer, you're off from school, you go to your dad's uh, shop, and how many days a week are you open? Seven days. Seven days a week. How many days a week do you work? Seven days. Seven days? Yeah. Every day? Yeah. From open until close? Yeah. You're out there waiting and, and, and waiting for customers? Yeah. Okay. In June of 2011, your first month open, how many customers came in? Zero. Zero. In July of last year, how many customers came in? Zero. Zero, two months. In August, how many customers came in? One. One. <laughs> One customer. Who was the customer? Nirvan. Nirvan, who made the film that we just saw, right? Yeah. And Nirvan was also smart enough at the time to record you what, at your first customer when he first paid you the first time. And there's just a 30 second clip that you have to see on YouTube here of, of uh, Kane's first customer walking in. Got it? The arcade. What? Welcome <laughs> up to the arcade. Kane's arcade. It's a kid's arcade. And then uh, so, how, how does it work? It's $1 for four tokens? Yes. Yeah. And then two dollars, you get how many? You get how many turns? Eight. Eight turns. Wait, I thought what's the five hundred turns? Five hundred turns is a fun pass. And that's how much? Two dollars. Two dollars. Yeah, we want the fun pass. Okay, yeah, we'd like a fun pass, please. Fun pass, okay. Dodge two photos. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, We're gonna share our turns. Two turns. Mhm. All right. Wait, wait. I want the. I want to hold the fun pass. Yeah. Awesome. This is a fun pass. Do you want to hold this to it? You need to okay. All right. So what are the games we got here? Yeah. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, I don't hold play on. basketball. I don't play soccer. <laughs> this, this is a grand opening? Yeah. So exciting. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear him, but he ran around. He's like... My first customer, I need change. <laughs> so, Kane, we're at this business school. We're teaching people how to start companies, how to price, how to market, and there's all these lessons in here. Let's talk about your pricing strategy, okay? <laughs> so, your pricing is $1 gets you what? Four turns. Four turns, one dollar. For two dollars, what do I get? A fun pass. A fun pass, and that's how many turns again? Five hundred. Five hundred. <laughs> so there's real, real value in the fun pass, <laughs> right? And now, you told me yesterday that you added a new pricing plan for families. Can you share that with us? Yeah. It costs them $11.99. $11.99. For six fun passes. Six fun passes, $11.99. So Six. I want to do the math for everybody because there's some people that that were told there'd be no math, but there's six fun passes that usually cost two dollars, right? Yeah. So that's a total of twelve dollars, and you're selling it for how much? Eleven ninety nine. Eleven ninety nine. So that one cent value is just really, really key, isn't it? That's fantastic. <laughs> so let's talk about during the time that you didn't have any customers during June and July, and even, even after Nirvan came, there weren't a lot of customers. Um,
Did you ever think of closing? No. No. Did you think of like shrinking the business or did you think of making it larger? Larger. Larger. You have no customers and you say that's the perfect time to expand. Yeah. Right? Yeah. That's a great philosophy. You always have to press <laughs> forward regardless. And we talked about advertising. You asked your dad to advertise. Where are some of the places you thought of advertising? Billboard. Billboard by the freeway, right off the freeway on yeah. Where else did you want to spend some money? On TV. TV. Television advertising for Kane's Arcade. You also talked about the radio. Isn't it kind of funny that you said TV, radio, <laughs> internet, and you have all those things and you didn't even have to pay for them because of the film, right? Yeah. Internet marketing. <laughs> Very smart. Very smart. Okay, let's talk. These guys are really hardcore business people. How much did it cost to start your business? How much? A couple dollars. A couple dollars. A couple dollars. And now uh, for uh, your scholarship foundation, they've now raised close to $200,000? Yes. $200,000? This is, uh, and growing, by the way, and growing. This is a picture from a week or so ago, two weeks ago maybe, when uh, Nirvan and everyone presented the check for what was then $152,000, is now $190,000 to his scholarship fund. So a couple dollars yeah. to start, $200,000. What's the return on investment for something like that? About <laughs> 100,000%. 100,000%. That's dead on. <laughs> no, you, you, know, you did that math in your head. All these guys are breaking out like their HP 12Cs, like about 200,000 divided by, it's 100,000%. <laughs> that is the most profitable return of any business we've ever heard in this, in this classroom. So congratulations. <laughs>